The Language of Nature Doctrine of Signatures and Healing Properties of the Plants The 12,000-year-old bristlecone pine tree is a teacher plant teaching us about the doctrine of signatures and how to open to connection with the plant kingdom. The doctrine of signatures is part of the language of nature showing us through the shapes, colors, gestures, habitat, scent, what the essence of the flower or the tree or the plant is and what its healing qualities are. The elements, the earth element helps us be aware of our physicality, our body, how to hold energy and release energy. It is softening and it is expresses itself through the plants, the mountains, the trees, and the earth itself. The fire element is transforming, always like a fire burning, burning bright. It is the flame of our passion, our life force, our creative energy, and how we express ourselves in the world. The water element helps us flow, relax, attuned to our feeling nature, our inner nature. Helps us open our heart again and again and again. The air elemental reminds us of the breath connecting with spirit always bringing our attention to the divine. The ethers brings all of the elements together into unity and beauty and support as we stand in the center. Colors the doctrine of the signature reminds us that the red ones, like the chakras, ground us and align our will. The orange come up to our second chakra and ignite our passion, creativity, pleasure, our ability to have healthy relationships and to honor our own creativity. The yellow flowers can bring us out of depression and bring a sunny radiance to ourselves and confidence. They can align with the third chakra, our personal power and ability to express and act in the world. The green flowers connect us with the heart of Mother Earth. They also bring harmony and heart healing and balance. Pink flowers work on the heart too and the universal love. Blue flowers are for communication, our voice, self-expression, our vulnerability, and opening ourselves to fully engage with life. The purple flowers Engage our third eye, our intuition, our ability to vision and see with spiritual sight. And the white flowers purify us, connect us with the divine. And like the phantom orchid, it can light our way through the illusion. Shapes. The shapes of the flower are significant. As you can see, the bleeding heart is meant for the heart. The dove of the dove orchid of peace brings us that beautiful quality. Flowers that point downward like the chocolate lily 
bring our embodiment into greater joy and belonging. Here the poet's shooting star reminds us to be here now. The fuchsia points us to the earth. And the cup shape is a receptive flower shape and it opens us to receiving love, our value, and here, Divine Mother energies of the Mariposa Lily. The stalk flowers like the White Bog Orchid bring us the vertical spine alignment and energy to stand up tall and straight and powerfully and open our perception. Here the Calla Lily shows a beautiful blending of the masculine and the feminine in one flower. Glacier Lily, express yourself, stop hiding, bring that sunny expression out. The Grass Widow, dance like a ballerina with joy. And the Fairy Slipper, if you slip on the Fairy Slippers, you can journey to new places without fear. The Ocean Spray, it's like the foamy waves and moves energy, especially in our second chakra. Numbers and patterns. The flowers hold significance in their numbers, like the number five for the five fingered and five toed humans. The roses express the five energy as a flower for humanity, for our healing, for our nervous system. The lilies express the three beautifully. Here's a tr trillium. And the patterns of the flowers, like the stripes and the sacred geometry, offers us beautiful patterns of healing. Scent. Scent brings us to the divine. Here the lilac brings us that euphoria. The yarrow has a bitter scent. And the jasmine-like smell of the white bog orchid can transform our worries and struggles. Habitat. Where a plant grows will affect the essence and the signature of the plant as well. Here we have plants growing out of or under the water. gestures. The sensitive plant shrinks when you touch it. Perfect medicine for the sensitive person. Choya cactus brings frequency and protection. This plant actually bent over and made itself into an essence. Beautiful medicine to open our fairy heart. See if you can notice the doctrine of signatures as expressed in nature around you. Thank you for watching.